times a charm. How you guys doing? Is you during? Cause I'm during. So first thing we'll talk about is oh, that no more pocket spots in your hair, girl. I know I haven't done um videos in a hot minute, and I apologize. Is it too late to apologize? It's too late. Too late to apologize. It's too late. I guess anybody know that song? No. Yes, no, no, yes, no. Anyway, um, so life has been... Yeah. Um, so I cut my hair again. So I cut all that was sitting down here because I fried it when I went to bleach it. And uh, it was looking... Stupid. So I got that cut off. I'm much, much happier with this. Um, the mullet is growing out um, and doesn't look so bad. So I'm pretty happy with that. Um, I love the color. Life is boring right now. I'm helping my mom, um, you know, my mother in law move in. Um, we're just working on getting me healthy, so I'm going to the gym. I'm swimming. I'm doing the, uh, today at 6.30, there's a, uh, there is a, thinky, 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 uh, there's a, what is it called? An aerobics class in the pool, and I'm going to go take that. And then I'm going to go swim for maybe two hours or something after that. So, um... Yes, so now I'm going back to the gym. I'm working out. I'm feeling better about myself in that aspect. Um, my mind is a little lately, but that's okay. Um, I restart brain painting next Monday. Um, I was doing just therapy for a while because uh, I needed therapy to, to talk about some issues and stuff. And now I'm going to go back to my brain painting, which will probably help me tremendously. I'm still taking my Wellbutrin. Um, I'm taking the immediate release Wellbutrin. There is an extended and there's an immediate. If you are taking it and you have gastric bypass, you need the immediate release because we don't really digest the extended release pills that well. So I take 300 milligrams, which is four pills, um, two, you know, in the morning, two in the evening. Seems to work okay. Um, excuse me. Oh, yeah, I got my new shipment of my Patch MD, and I think I'll show you what I got. So, this month, um, I have narrowed down, um, so I'm going to be doing the CoQ10, which is formulated to support optimal mitochondria biogenesis function. I don't know what that means. Uh, targeted ingredients including super antioxidants, minerals, and amino acids to assist in the enhancement of restoration of the functionality capability of your mitochondria. Say that ten times fast. Holy moly. Uh, so, um, yeah. I got the sleep starter again. So I put these on um, 30 minutes before bed and they actually really do help me start to get sleepy. Uh, that's why I ordered them again. I really love these. Uh, I got my, my double iron. I told you guys, um, you know, I have, I have an issue with a little bit of low iron. So I take two patches every day. And then I've got my good <laughs> This one for my joints, for my joint meats, because I got to get my joint meats working. So um, now you're going to ask me why am I not taking the vitamin D and calcium and why am I not taking the um, multivitamin? Well, the answer is a simple because I'm taking an oral multivitamin with iron to try to help me with my iron issues and I'm taking the Upcal D. I have a review of other... Um, I think it's called Global Health. Are you called Global Health? No, 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 no. Global Health products. They sent me a whole bunch of shiz. Um, I got a bunch of stuff to review. I just haven't got to it yet. So I've been taking these. Yes, I, oh my God, I gotta tell you. I broke, I finally broke a nail. I haven't broken a nail ever. Um, in months and months and months and months. Well, I probably haven't broken a nail in over a year. And it's because... Um, the pool 
and I guess the 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 nail underneath it which is my nail had gotten really soft and it started peeling on the end and me being there I, I pulled it and you know it was just going to kind of clip it off because it was aggravating me and I guess that kind of took some of the foundation of what was holding it up and uh, so it broke and I was like so I won't be doing that again. I need to go back and, and you know, because they're going to charge me $5 to fix that. And I'm going to be like, it doesn't cost you guys $5 to fix one nail, but whatever. So I'll get my nails fixed soon. Liking this color in my hair. In my hair. Um, so like I said, guys, life is pretty boring for me. Uh, painting rocks sitting around and um, kind of keeping to myself for a bit um not really not really much into you know chatting at the moment just kind of doing my own stuff kind of stuck in my head and that's okay you know that is okay there's nothing wrong with being stuck in your head yuki get out of your damn crotch Whatever's in there is either stuck or, you, you know, is never, it's meant to be. Just leave it alone. Jeez. Got some. Yuck. Um, yeah, life is okay, guys. I just wanted to get on here and kind of just yammer at you and let you know. Oh, I'm doing the gallon challenge. So that is 16 cups of water. That is 128 ounces. You don't have to get 128 ounces. It's just mainly um, trying to get as much water as you possibly can in per day because it's good for you. And it is good for you. Um, you know, I noticed that my energy was kind of bad and I was, my TMI, my pee was getting kind of dark and it was smelly. Um, and that I just realized that I'm not drinking enough water and so I decided to do this is day five and I get in probably at least a hundred ounces if not a little bit more before bedtime so uh, this morning I've already gotten like 32 ounces and this will be another um, I got these two to go through another 32 ounces while I'm sitting here uh, working on the computer and probably uploading this video and then um, it's pretty early I think it's and that's one hour behind so it's what six something I don't know it's something it is something o'clock <laughs> so I don't I don't clock here you know you don't come on here to find out what time it is so don't know more about it don't worry about it um yeah guys I'm I'm just working on getting my stuff together and getting my life back together. I'm, there's a lot of stuff up in the air for me, and I'm just trying to process what I want to do for the rest of my life. I'm really trying to focus on, do I want to go back to school? Um, do I want to try to get a job? Uh, do I want, to, what kind of job do I want to get? Uh, you know, there's a lot of stuff. See, I have an associate's degree in medical billing and administration, but I got it from um, uh, University of Phoenix back when I was like 500 pounds and I couldn't go to a university. And so they pretty much just, I'm going to say, you know, raped me with uh, the promise of, Yuki, get out of your crotch! Get out of your crotch! Gross! Well, look over there. She's going to town. Quit it. Ugh. Anyway, so, um, ugh. squirrel. What was I going to say? Oh, yeah, so, um, I have an associate's degree from, oh, yeah, they, like I was saying, they, they, uh, pretty much raped my, my butt for uh, uh, fees and stuff and then it find out later on it's not accredited school so you know my associate's degree doesn't count and a lot of the um, stuff that I took um, won't transfer somewhere else so it's it's kind of depressing and you know to find out that you know, all that work that I that I did and all that money that you know I owe um, is for a charlatan company and it makes me very very sad so yeah I, I'm trying to figure out what we want to do I'm very unhappy with the election and what happened um, 
but you know I'm not trying to down anybody that voted for him So that's all I have to say about that. Um, that's just life, guys. Like, you just got to do the best you can with what you've got. And me and Matthew were looking into Canada. We're looking into Montre um, uh, Montreal. And because they have a, a good, you know, it's cheap to live there. Matthew can go to school there. They have a wonderful university there. Uh, it's not here. <laughs> So we're just we're just kind of keeping our options open and just doing everything that we can. I'm just trying to figure out what I want to do with my life. And I'm sorry this video is probably incredibly, incredibly boring. Uh, I apologize uh, for that. And I'm going to get off here because, I, of course, I've yammered way too long. I love your beautiful, gorgeous, amazing faces. I promise you as soon as my my head meets are back on where they're supposed to be I will come back with some decent content um, I've been trying to figure out how to record going to the pool but I'm scared that my phone will get wet so I've been looking into getting a GoPro because they they're they have a waterproof GoPro thingy but they're like four or five hundred dollars I'm like why is it got to be so expensive cuz I'd take you guys in the pool with me I'd be like I'll take you guys swimming with me and go, and go to the pool and be all here's how I do my workout in the pool girl yeah but um the GoPros are expensive and uh I have a weird phone I have a, a Nexus 6P so I haven't found a good waterproof um thing for this either all right guys i love your beautiful gorgeous amazing faces i hope everybody's having a wonderful rest of their week and i will definitely talk to you soon Mwah. bye